you can't hear me. Oh, thank you for the raid. Sorry for the past 11 minutes. Apparently my, um, my PC started to, I don't know, for some reason it just decided to bonk out. So I apologize. Um, I don't know. Sometimes, sometimes the software doesn't play nice. So, no, you don't have to start your browser. I do apologize. I'll kind of quickly start over. I am so sorry. Um, it happens sometimes. Um, so, yeah, I am really sorry about that. But I'll quickly give you a rundown of what you've missed. Um, so, I am UO Fenico. I am the a community manager for Ultima Online here. And we are doing the Legends EM event with EM Kalima. Uh, Santa is looking for some help. Uh, Santa's reindeer were kidnapped. Some carolers were kidnapped. The toys were taken. We're trying to save Christmas. So that's what we're. That's what's going on right now. Um, I answered Ancients One's question about the flapping wings. I do understand. Yes, the flapping wings can di get distracting. I will try to remember to turn that off. Um, violence in video games. And yes, thank you for the raid. Um, says, it happens. My camera stopped working as soon as my stream started, so I understand. Yes, sometimes the software doesn't like to play nice. <laughs> and of course, it's always... You know, you test it and test it and test it a hundred times and you're like, hey, it's working great. Everything's working great. And then it doesn't. <laughs> so you do your best, but sometimes, you know what, electronics just don't play well together. So again, yes, and we do. We have to save Christmas. So we've got the Reindeer King over here. Hello, Poinka Poinka. Hello. Welcome to the stream. Oh, who dares to try and stop me and my herd? Oh, my. Well, everyone here, of course. There will be no holiday this year. Mwahahaha. <laughs> oh, no. Not if we can help it. Not if we can help it. Everybody will, will, oh no, more hired ogres. Be careful. Lots of hired ogres. Be careful, everyone. So yes, um, as I said, I am Fenico. And uh, yes, the reindeer king is intense. Yes, he is. He looks very angry. I'm thinking he's upset. You think you can stop me from ruining Christmas? Oh, thank you. Well, we love that you love Ultima Online. Yes, and no, <clears throat> thank you for watching. I really appreciate it. Thank you. Um, so it sounds like the reindeer might be a little upset, and I have a theory. I think that he's upset that he did not get to be a part of the team that drives Santa's sleigh. I'm betting that's what it is. Just a theory, of course. Play with my naughty friends. Roars with laughter. Oh, dear, dear, dear. Oh, these ogres. They don't look good, so be careful, everyone. My goodness. So, as I said before, uh, well, as I said before, but it was, <laughs> nobody could hear me. Um, lag, I know. There, there's a lot of lag, and one thing we have to remember is that EM events, there is a lot of people, and sometimes in a very small area. So that being said, you know, EMs, they're rock stars. They try to do their very best to make sure that everybody is, 
you know, in these areas um, and comfortable in these areas and make them big enough and stuff like, you know, all that great stuff. But sometimes, you know, you, you try everything you can and, you know, it happens. And we're okay with that because we're here for the story. We're here for the enjoyment. We're just here to have a good time, right? Cookie Lady Lancer, Maine. Hello. <laughs> I love your cat with sunglasses emoji. That is adorable. Yeah, Violence Video Games says, love the EMs. They do amazing work. They really, really do. They try really hard. They come up with some amazing stories, some amazing ideas. I mean, you can see the deco that has been done for this event. A lot of care and love is put into these events. And you can you can see it. You know, you can feel it when when they do these. So... I, I always say, and I, I can't say it enough, please, please tell your EMs, you know, hey, you're awesome. You know, they, I think they need to hear that sometimes. I think everyone needs to hear that. So you know what? Everybody watching, you're awesome. So there you go. I think everybody needs to hear that, that, you know, and get those warm fuzzies. So yeah. Ooh, these are some naughty creatures for sure. They sure are. They do not look good. And yes, uh, the flapping animation, um, you can turn that off. And uh, you'll find it in your options menu. So I will, uh, I do know that when you do that, you have to restart um, your client. So we're not going to do that right now, but definitely. We'll do it again. Shout out to the EM here on this shard and Raia on my shard. There you go. Shout out from Violence in Video Games. Says shout out to EM Kalima and EM Raia on uh, Sonoma. So wonderful. Always love to hear that. Again, you know, the, the EMs, they're absolute rock stars. You know, like I said... Be sure to tell your EM, you know, or and any shard, really. Be sure to tell your EM, you know, hey, you're, you're pretty awesome. So we're still, we're still battling this out. It looks like we have some um, evil twins kind of popping up all over the place. So be careful there. Everybody seems to be working really, really hard, though. So good job. Good job, everybody. And we've got Santa over here. And if you are wondering how to get here, say you're just tuning in and you're like, how do I get to this? You're going to want to go on Legends. And you're going to want to go to the Counselor's Hall. Now, if you don't know where that is, head towards, it's in Britain, head towards the castle. That building where it's got like a, globe on a pedestal and all that neat stuff that's the counselor's hall right before the bridge to castle um Cla castle blackthorn you're gonna find a gate and that gate is what's gonna lead you right here so we're still going still going but everybody's doing a wonderful job Everybody's working so hard. We got Santa here just kind of watching and going, okay, you got this. Good job. But yeah, look at all the deco. I mean, goodness, there's a lot going on here. And I'm going to go back to down here so you can kind of get an idea. But Look at this Santa stolen naughty list. We have again the broken and chipped dolly. Santa stolen nice list. Even our uh, broken hula hoops. Sorry, I saw the evil twin and <laughs> tangled and frayed jump rope. We've got unusable pieces of an erector set. A broken doll bed. Oh my. So we've got lots of things going on here and ice lights, but that's why I constantly tell people when you see builds like this, please take the time to look at what 
you know, your your EHEM has done because, you know, they, they have these these cute names and it's it's those little things that they put into their events, those just little tidbits that just make it all the more special. And I think it's wonderful that they do that. I really, really do. Cause it's it's just amazing to me. I, I love it. I absolutely love it. So we've got lots of trees going on. We've got telescope over here. Looks like uh they're uh burnt nutcracker. Oh no, they're burning all the toys. Burnt baby doll bed, jack in the box. What's in the big glass containers? Well, it looks like maybe these are what um, the evil reindeer king has been making. I'm guessing they're these ogres over here that he's made these ogres or something. And they've broken out. That would be my guess. Oh, look. Let's see. We've got a paint set. Uh, toy soldiers. I mean, just just so many wonderful things. I, I really do recommend coloring books. See, it's the little things. They won't be getting any special carrots this year. Oh, my. Oh, my. Those poor reindeer. What are we going to do? Well, we'll have to do our best. We'll just have to do our best and get everybody we can and help. We we got to make sure Christmas happens. We got to make sure this holiday happens, right? There we go. Love seeing players helping each other. And you can see the wall of names, wall of names. And that's that's you know, normal for an EM event. So if you're unfamiliar, that is 100% normal for an EM event. Still lots going on. My goodness. And I know I've said it before, but I love seeing all the unique you know, armor colors and stuff that, that people use. It, it's so, I, I just love it. Some of the outfits that I see, it's just, oh man, I never would have thought of that. You know, oh gosh, that really does look good together. Hopefully we can get these all beaten back. Indeed, Santa, indeed, doing everything we can. And yes, a lot of flappy gargoyles. And I've said it before, after the EM events, you know, you want something to do. Well, let me tell you, UO still has some amazing things going on, and we've got some amazing, we've got some stuff coming up yet, too. So if you're wondering what you can do in your free time in UO, well, we've got Krampus going on right now. All you have to do is start a trade run, start going, and hopefully, if you're lucky enough, Krampus will spawn. And there's some new items that you can potentially get from Krampus in addition to the old items. So that's exciting. And then we have the Artisan Festival, if fighting's not your thing, that's okay too. Say you have a crafter and you just love to craft. Well, you can do uh, bulk order deeds and you drop them at, on the elves and it helps build the tree for each city. I do believe Moonglow is the city currently that has a tree so if you uh want to help out moon glow or you just want to you know put uh, a, a bulk order deed on there so you can get a prize because you do um then yeah go for it um now it now let's say you put 10 bods on 
the elf on a single character, you're only going to get one prize. You're not going to get 10. So it's usually generally like one per character. So if you, it doesn't matter how many bods you put on, you're only going to get one item. So make sure you, you get the most out of that. I know if you've got like five characters, split it amongst your five characters and get, you know, make sure they all get them because, you know, depending on your fame and karma depends on what kind of stuff you're going to get. There's new things right now. So lots and lots of fun going on there. And then we also have the champ spawn coming up real soon. And you're not going to want to miss that because there's some really, really cool stuff for that champ spawn. And uh, if you haven't seen it, you're going to want to check out the uh, newsletter or the uo.com site. Or you can check out the town crier that um, was put up on uo.com. Any one of those things, you can check them out. You can check out the UO forum, the official forum. We have some great stuff there as well. But you're definitely going to want to keep in the know about these things because there's plenty to do for the month of December and you don't want to miss out on any of them. So, Violence in Video Games says, Krampus is a lot of fun, especially for a tamer with a good coup or good nightmare. And I would definitely agree. If you are a tamer... It, it works out great, but you know what? Any template, get out there. It's, it's always fun. Get a group together and just go to town. I, you're going to have fun. You really, really are. It's, it's a blast. I, I like doing Krampus. I love doing all the things uh, for you, you know, the Artisan Festival Krampus, and I'm really excited for the Champ Spawn coming up soon. So, all of that, I think, is going to be a lot of fun and with some new items coming out, lots of, you know, things to collect if that's your thing or maybe you're going for a specific thing, you know, lots you can trade between, you know, other people or maybe you're just going to sell them. Either way, I mean, hey, it's going to be a blast. All right. We are going to keep a look down here. And yeah, it's still going. Now we've got vengeful polar bears. Oh dear. Oh my goodness. They're burning toys. And there's vengeful polar bears. Oh. Oh, Santa. This doesn't look good at all. I thought polar bears were nice. I thought they were too. Somebody needs to get him a bottle of Coca-Cola. I heard that's what helps, right? <laughs> Can't give him Snickers, otherwise I would say Snickers. You're not you when you're when you're angry or when you're hungry, yeah. You're certainly not very friendly. No, they are not. They don't look friendly at all. They seem to be attacking everyone, dear Santa. I don't think that's friendly. Not at all. Some eggnog. There you go. Get him some eggnog. Quickly. And fun fact, there is eggnog in the game. With a little tr Christmas cheer in the eggnog. Indeed. There you go. That's the spirit. Lots of holiday cheer all around. Oh my goodness. Seeing people put up um, a lot of reapers to kind of help out. Those are always good for helping. Colossus, tamers, any, anything like that is always great. I passed around some ale as gifts, Violence in Video Games says, to some players earlier. Did you? That was very nice of you. There you go. See? Love to hear that. Love to hear that. Love to hear players helping players or players just, you know, getting in the spirit of stuff. Having a good time, you know? That's always great. I love that. 
Santa says, you can do it. Indeed. You've got this, everyone. You've got this. And again, if you're just joining in and you want to get and come and be a part of, you know, what's going on here, it is on the Legends Shard. And all you have to do is go, go up towards, in Britain, go towards Lord Blackthorne's castle. And uh, just by the bridge, you're going to see a moon gate. Uh, I do believe it was a pink moon gate. And you just pop it in there and it'll it'll put you here. And then just look for all the names. Just all the names. No specific one, just all. You can't miss us. It's a good thing we're not on a secret mission. That might get complicated. For the joy and excitement of presents, you can do it. Oh, yes. Presents are good. But it's the joy of giving, is it not? Santa says, hello. Oh, love the event. Oh, that was very nice. Wonderful. Love to see it. Love to see it. You are all doing great to save the holidays. Yes, indeed. Everybody's doing such a wonderful job. That king reindeer doesn't stand a chance. Not at all. Not against the great players of Legends. And fun fact about Legends, by the way, is if you remember way back in the heyday, uh, Legends wasn't always just called Legends. In fact, it was called AOL. If you remember AOL, that's America Online. It used to be called America Online Legends. So AOL Legends. So it's, it's always interesting, I know. And it was the one shard that if you had AOL, you could play on and have a good time. So again, that's, that's old, old school info. But I always, I always find it, I, I love the history of Ultima Online. So it's always great You can never know too much about UO lore and history and all that great stuff. Just never can. And the fun thing is, is even when you think you know it all, something pops up and you're like, oh, I didn't know that. That's crazy. So we have some vengeful reindeer coming in now. Be careful, everyone. Vengeful reindeer. Violence Video Game says, I remember that. And I do love the lore. See? Yes, I, I love the different, you know, tidbits of, of Ultima lore and everything. It's, it's always fun. Highly, you know, fall. Go ahead and fall down the UO lore rabbit hole. It's, it's always a fun read. It really is. Yeah, we're still going here. I'm going to kind of take just a quick look around at everybody, see how everybody's doing. So we came in up here. It looks like everybody's kind of moved into this general vicinity, which is good. We're still fighting some vengeful reindeer. Vengeful reindeer. Vengeful reindeer, yes, indeed.
There we go. Fun, fun, fun. I see people are throwing up some Colossus. That's good. Lots of pets here. All different kinds of templates. And you know what? There really is no good or bad template per se for Ultima. There really isn't. There's no good or bad template per se. There are templates that will help you in, better in some situations than in others. Um, for EM events, there's so many great templates out there. Um, I, I definitely recommend playing around with, you know, templates a little bit um, to see what works for you. Um, I know I've, I've seen so many uh, different templates. You have your uh, Tamer Mage Spellweaver. You have your Mystic Mage Spellweaver. You have um, your Sampire. You have your Throwers. You have Archers. There's just such a large, you know, opportunity um, to make different templates for EM events. So please don't be afraid you know, oh, well, I only have this character to go to an EM event. Please don't be afraid. Come to the EM events. You know, they're a lot of fun. And yeah, I mean, not to mention if you're building up a character, it's a great way to kind of build up that character, especially if you're working like archery or majory or any one of those skills. Honestly, as you fight, you know, that's going to keep going up. So it's a good way to kind of... Um, get that template built up while still having a great time and listening to the story and getting immersed in everything. So I would highly recommend, you know, getting involved. Um, and, and if there, there's so many, I mean, there's so many shards that do this. I mean, we, again, this is very, you know, this is very specific to, Ultima Online to us. Um, so it's, it's, it's really great. As long as you're having fun, you can for sure play how you like. I take my treasure mapper to events too, says violence in video games. Absolutely. Um, it's fun to just come and look at all the cool deco the EMs place for the storyline, says uh, Trinidadi. Yes, it is. I, I said I love looking at the decorations that the EMs do. They do a spectacular job. Again, they are absolute rock stars. So, and as I said it before, I'll say it again, mouse over all the little things. They, they, they work hard. So... Definitely don't miss on the little things because the it's it's adorable. I I personally love it. I think it's great. So we still have lots of stuff going on here. We've got still plenty of these reindeer running around. Um, as you can tell, I mean they're they're yeah. They they're kind of everywhere. My goodness. And we've got Santa still right over here. He's in kind of in the middle here. He's kind of moving down a little bit. I'm sure to make sure and encourage everybody to, to do their best. And I'm sure everyone here is absolutely doing their, their bestest. Looks like we've got a lot of poison going on over here in this area, so be careful. Highly, highly suggest uh, when you come to EM events, bring orange petals. Just a little tidbit. Bring orange petals whenever you go to EM events. Trust me, they do come in handy. The reindeer king has truly made these reindeer go mad. Oh, dear. Go mad, you say? Indeed, Santa. It looks like they have. And I know the one thing that I always tell, uh, I tell everybody when they, whenever they've 
any whenever they've asked me at any point what is the one thing you should go to an em event with that you you just should never leave your house or your bank or your inn without and i would have to say it's the undertaker staff and that thing is absolutely amazing when it comes to em events uh fight bravely adventurers you can do this uh, undertaker staff if you're not familiar with it basically you die and say you die and your body is in woo, this mess where you've got like stuff going on um poison all that good stuff you've you know you see that and you can't quite get to your body um you use the undertaker staff you double click it and it'll bring the body to you so that you can, um, you know, double click it and get what you need out of it. Say you've got bandages or something, you know, you've got something in there that wasn't exactly, you know, um, blessed or insured. So highly recommend it. Um, orange petals for sure. I would, I would say orange petals. And then, uh, the third item that I think has been very useful, and this is just in general, if you're going out and fighting anything is the brand new, um, the uh, chalice. And it prevents a monster from stealing from you for a certain time. So those are things I, I definitely recommend always kind of keeping on hand because you're definitely going to need them. I don't leave my home without them. You can be sure they aren't going to the good place for the holidays, but, says Santa, I love the little dancing dinosaurs, violence video games. We have bigger issues on hand. Oh, my. What would that be? I saw the reindeer king here. Indeed, we did. He's a big one, he is. He's a big guy. He must be stopped. Indeed. We will stop him, the players say. Let's stop him. Indeed. Everybody's ready. They're ready to fight that, that reindeer king. Or I'm afraid he'll just regroup. We can't have that. And this will have been in vain. Oh, yeah, no. Then I guess we need to stop him. Definitely. Unless you don't want presents under the tree. <laughs> Good, we're on the same page then. Make sure to have your chimney ready because, you know, Santa. Let me see if my magic tracking works here so I can find him. Oh, I hope it does. Uh, Violent says, kick his. Hmm, I mean, defeat him. Indeed. Wiggles beard. That's impressive. Aha, uh -huh, says Santa. I think I know where he is. <gasps> That's wonderful. Everybody says, let's go. Shakes magic gloves. Let's see. Let me see if I can get this right. If so, I'll open a portal to where the beast is hiding. All right. Oh, we're lacing up our shoes now. Wiggles gloves. Oh, I do believe Santa might have moved. Or was I seeing things? 
I might have been seeing things. Oh, nope. Everybody's come down here now. And there's the gate. Everybody pop in. All right. If you're looking for the gate, I'm going to quick pop my map up very quickly so you can see this is where we are. So you want to hurry up, get in that gate. Don't want to miss out. And it is a green and looks like orange gate. All right, let's pop in. Oh my. Yep. And uh, one moment. One moment. It happens sometimes. We've had it happen before. And uh, it's okay. It's okay. It just happens. Uh, there's a lot of people and everybody going through that little gate, sometimes it clogs up the works. And uh, that's what happens, you know? So we're just going to get right back in there. We're just going to get right back in there. There we go. See that? Look at that. Just like that. We're right back. Right back where we need to be, right? Right. There we go. We have popped in here and we're in a grassy area. We've got a healer on one end over here. Okay. And we're just gonna kinda wait for uh, the boss to drop, I guess. Jack Sparrow, already drinking. No need to panic. Panic! <laughs> Trinidad, he says, I see you. Hi. <laughs> All right. We're just going to kind of be patient. We're just going to wait again. There's a lot of people and, uh, you know, you just got to be patient. Oh, nope. There he is. The reindeer king. There he is. Get him, everybody. Get him. Get that reindeer king. I'm just going to pull his bar up so we can kind of watch as we go. I'm going to kind of root you guys on because I know you got this. Again, the healer is just off to the right of my screen. Uh, if you're looking, everybody's uh, taking them down pretty pretty well. It's going very, very well. Look at that. Very nice. Very nice. A little bit of a lag spike there. That's okay. That's okay. Reindeer King. Oh, gone down. We're going again. Bar needs to be lowered just a bit. Oh, I see that. Yes, it's right behind the Fenico. I was hiding it. <laughs> Keeping you all in suspense. There we go. The Reindeer King. <laughs> Thank you, Violence and Video Games. All right. We got the Reindeer King. We've almost got him down a second time. Everybody's doing amazing, amazing job. Okay, we've got another. You got this. Oh, he's definitely fighting back. He doesn't want to go down so easy, I'm telling you. He says, no. A 
Lots of spell casting I'm seeing. Very good. Very, very good. Y'all got this. Y'all got this. Almost. Doing great. Doing great. Doing great. He's down again. Looks like he recovered about 75% of his health. Oh, and he's down. That's it. It's done. He's done. Dunzo. He is done. Stick a fork in him because he's done. Good job, everybody. Wonderful job. Yay. Good job. I'm just going to keep an eye out for Gates to pop up. So good job, everybody. Yay. And there's the gate. Look at that. A snazzy color. I like that. That is a very nice gate. Okay, everybody, pile on in. Let's go home. <laughs> all right. We're all kind of making our way back. Oh, door closed on me. How rude. <laughs> yes, yay. Indeed. We got to hype it up. And look at the hall is decorated so nicely. Look at that. It's beautiful. This was awesome, says Poinka Poinka. Yes! See? This is, this is what the EM events are all about. They're a lot of fun. Highly, highly recommend you you join one. There's plenty going on yet this month. And in between, UO's got plenty to offer to keep you busy for the holidays. So please, you know, get out there. Get out there. There's so much to do. Never a dull moment. Okay, and we're just going to wait patiently. Oh, I'm sure we'll see it. Don't worry. Yes, post-event robes now available by clicking on the painting. Don't do it. <laughs> yeah, that's what happens. If you click on the painting, that's what happens. I don't know if you saw it. I won't give away the secret. But I will say, just take a look at uh, these guys over here. <laughs> I think once you take a look at that, you're you're gonna see exactly. <laughs> I warned you, don't click it. I said, don't click it. Nobody listens to Fenico. So, yes, we do have um, the EM is uh, the EM on this shard is EM Kalima. And you can find all of Kalima's information. Uh, there's a lantern here that has the email. Um, so if you need to contact your EM, do check your EM halls and stuff like that. So you can kind of get a look um, if you need to get in contact with them. Some of them will even have something in Luna or at West Brent Bank. So, you know, check around. I'm glad they got a res, but it was kind of funny. Yes, it is always entertaining. And they always, they always manage to get one. Always manage to get one. And it even says, double click at your own risk. So... Just saying, just saying. 
Oh, Santa is here. Uh, thank you all so much, says Santa. You're welcome, Santa. We're all just happy to help. Yes, see, people are saying my pleasure, our pleasure, indeed. Uh, for coming and defeating those nasty old Bah Humbug reindeer. Yes, it happens. Oh, and the item, the prize, if you were lucky, it says Santa's book of naughty and nice players. Are you naughty or nice? Very, very cool. Very cool. I like that. I like that one. That one's very, very nifty. See if you're lucky, you can get a you can get one of the reward items when they do do these special events like this. But you know, sometimes it's just the reward is doing the story. Now the holidays can proceed. I'll get some elves down there to get the others out. Indeed. Uh, violence and video games says that's cool. The EMs are very creative with their item rewards. They are. They really are. There are so many items out there that they have made. They work so hard on them. Yeah. Oh, Violence says, uh, Cindy. Oh, hello, Cinderella. Oh, Cinderella says, it says ho, ho, ho when you click it. When you click the, the book, that's very cool. I like that. I love it. And yes, welcome, Cinderella. That is very, very cool. I love it. And if you want to see all the rewards, there is a gate just off to the side here outside. And uh, that'll take you to the reward halls that each EM has of their items that they have given out over the years. So lots of fun. I'm going to go see about getting the carolers out and all. That's good. They should be free too. They should be free too. But once again, thank you all so much. Christmas is saved. You're welcome. No coal for you. Yay! Everybody's on the good list. Yay! Toriana and Marcia say thank you. Yes, indeed. This was a lot of fun. Girl Scout says, thank you for the funsies. Uh, Kalima will be with you in just a moment. Well, there we go. Yay. Santa says, ho, ho, ho. Merry Christmas. There you go. And to you as well, Santa. Waves a good night. There we go. Woohoo. Way to go, Santa. Cinderella says, Merry Christmas. And poor Jack. You need to lay off the rum. Jack, I'm telling you, you need to lay off that rum. <laughs> It's a lot of rum, my guy. For you to have been drunk this whole time? That's a lot of rum. But yes, if you want to see all the EM event items over here, just go that way and uh, step on the teleporter and it'll take you there. And there is EM Kalima. So big hand for EM Kalima. Yay! What a wonderful event. E.M. Kalima says, evening, everyone. A wonderful event, indeed.
I want to thank our very own community manager, Fenico, as he was here streaming the event. Oh, you're welcome. Thank you for having me. So I hope everyone smiled big. <laughs> Indeed. Yes, this was a lot of fun. We will have to visit Legends again someday. <laughs> Jack says, I only charge five mil an hour. <laughs> Goodness. Well, I know where all that uh, money's going. Rum. <laughs> Kalima says, oh, Captain, I figure a barrel of rum will do. Indeed, and Jack agrees. <laughs> Lots of wonderful players. Legends is an amazing shard, and thank you all for having me here on Legends. I had a great time. I really did. Thank you for a wonderful evening. That would work for you too, Violence, huh? <laughs> Ian Kalima says, but I do want to wish you all the very best of happy holiday and new year. And to you as well. To you as well. Thank you for all you do for Legends. Indeed. Thank you, Legends. You are a wonderful shard. Thank you. Yes. Do be sure to say thank you to E.M. Kalima for such a wonderful job that they do each and every time. So everybody is, wow, just so wonderful. Yes, thank you for the fun. Happy holidays. Just wonderful. I love seeing the positivity. The positivity in UO. That's what I love to see. Okay, guys. You all get back to your last Shogun hunts. Get those in. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> I love the little graphics. I love the little the little graphics that uh get posted in the chat. It's wonderful. Um Kalima says glad you enjoyed it. I see you next year and Ema Kalima says absolutely. Stay safe. Uh this holiday season <laughs> Safe isn't fun. <laughs> I beg to differ. I want to see you guys next year. Definitely. We'll have to make another appearance next year. This was too fun to pass up again. So, yeah. Yes, Poinka Poinka says, keep up the good work. Definitely. Oh, Toriana says, next year, can we get the black and white candy canes? <laughs> so, yes, um, again, attend these EM events. They're a blast. Uh, you're not going to be sorry. They're a whole lot of fun. Um, and the EMs do such a great job. Again, they are absolutely rock stars at what they do. So be sure to tell them thank you um, when they do these because they do work very, very, very hard. Um, yeah, but other than that, be sure to check out. Again, we've got the Artisan Festival going on. I do believe Moonglow is the tree right now that you're going to want to be looking at. Cinderella says, thanks for the stream. It was fun listening to you. Well, thank you, Cinderella. I appreciate it. Um, I, again, Artisan Festival, I do believe the tree is in Moonglow right now. I, I do believe. Um, 
And then you've got Krampus going on, do your trade runs. And then we have the uh, Champ Spawn coming up very soon. So you won't want to miss out on that either. EM events uh, are still happening. So don't miss out on those. Uh, but please have a safe, happy holidays. And uh, yeah, I'm excited to see you all again very, very soon. I do about two EMs, or not two EMs, two EM events a month. And it's been a lot of fun so far. Uh, next month, we're going to showcase two other shards. So I'm going to try and get through all the shards. And then we're going to kind of revisit these shards. And we're going to kind of go through them all and everything. So uh, next month, we're going to take a look at two other shards that we have. And I'll keep those as a surprise. If you want to see my schedule and everything, you can check out the official UO forum. You'll see a post in the general discussion section all about um, past streams as well as future ones uh, and if you're seeing this on YouTube don't forget to hit that like button that subscribe button and I'll leave a little comment if you like uh, otherwise I will definitely see you again really really soon uh, I hope you have a great holiday I hope you have a happy new year and uh, please remember to be good to each other out there um, you know have a good time can't wait to see which shards are upcoming, says Violence. Yes, I'm excited. I am excited for next month's sh shards. So it's going to be a blast. So I'll be sure to put uh, the schedule up as soon as uh, I have that. But again, you know, have a good time. Be good. Be happy. You know, do good deeds because it's, it's good to do good. <laughs> and in case you need to hear it, you're amazing, you're wonderful, and you are awesome. In the meantime, again, have a great time. I will see you again really, really soon. All right. Take care, everyone. Bye. Don't forget to check out UO.com.